shoes. I'm gonna just put these over here for right now. But what's up, Guap Nation? It's your boy Guapo checking in here and today. Oh, I, I didn't, I didn't do my thing. It's your boy Guapo checking in here and today for all my Guap Nation fam on the channel. I decided to bring y'all something different. Now this video is gonna be the most affordable back to school shoes. So the most affordable shoes that I know of, cause I'm not just gonna tell y'all to get any random thing. These are all shoes that I know of or I have seen or that a friend has that they told me about. So I'm gonna bring y'all the most affordable shoes. So I got a little list rolling down over here that I'm gonna be looking at. And I ain't gonna lie to y'all cause it's a lot to remember. So this is just to help y'all with y'all back to school shopping. So if y'all, you know, your money a little tight, but you wanna be looking fresh. I got you, I got, I got you. So here we go, we ain't gonna waste no more time. Let's get into shoe number one. Now shoe number one is the Nike React Prestos, which are right here. Now, for the future of this video, some of these shoes I do have in person and some of them I don't. So for the ones that I don't have, I'm gonna be putting up pictures for y'all so y'all can see them just to give y'all a visual representation. But Nike, React Prestos right here, bomb bomb, look at that. And the price tag, 120. All the shoes on this list are gonna be under $150 cause I know once you hit that $200 price point, that's kind of pricey. I ain't gonna lie, I, your boy, I ain't got money like that. I don't know if y'all do, but I ain't got money like that. So ain't, no, ain't gonna be no Yeezys on here. 2,000 years later. My bad y'all, I kinda went on about that and kinda stretched that out longer than it should have been. But the Nike React Prestos, 120 on the dash coming out your pockets and let me show y'all what these look like. I already did a review for these, so if y'all haven't seen it, go check it out. But yeah, for 120, and I do wear my shoes too, by the way. That's one thing that I that I pride myself on. I don't just buy shoes just to keep them and hold them in my closet. I like to wear them. So these are kind of dirty, but hey, you know, I like to wear my shoes. So anyways, Nike React Prestos 120, you can't go wrong with these. These are a fire cop for all y'all that's going back to school, whether it's elementary school, high school, middle school, college, even though college ain't start yet, I think. We ain't gonna talk about that. But yeah, Nike React Presto. Let's go on to the next shoe. Now the next shoe that we have is the Air Max Plus, which is right here. And these bad boys, these these right here, I ain't gonna lie. They, they been through thick and thin with me. I don't know how they in, still in such a good condition. Well, I do know because, you know, I, I made a video on how I clean these. But yeah, if you haven't seen that, check that out too. And I'm not trying to make this like no video where I promote my older videos, but I have, these have been through thick and thin. As you can see, you see, you see the dirt right there? Like, I, I wear my shoes. But yeah, these were at a price point of, let me check real quick. Actually, I can look at the box. I don't have the price on the box. So these were going for 150 on the head. So including tax, you might be looking in the 160 range, but hey, for retail, 150, you can't go wrong. Nike Air Max Plus. Y'all can see I I'd be putting in some work with these shoes. The toe kind of y'all y'all see what's going on, but yeah. So 150, can't go wrong. Let's go on to the next shoe. Now the next shoe is a classic and that one will be a picture because I don't have a pair right now. I did in the past, but that was before I even thought about doing sneaker reviews and sneaker videos or just YouTube at all. But it's gonna be the classic, everybody knows this shoe, the Air Force One, the all white joints. You can't go wrong. I suggest low top. A lot of people go high top for whatever reason, I don't, I don't see the significance in going high top, but I suggest low top. And you you can't go wrong with Air Force. Of course, it's been around since caveman. We're making fires in the mountains. And you, you know what I'm trying to say. But yeah, Air Force Ones, you can't go wrong with them. They go for $90. So, you know, that's an affordable shoe. That's cheaper than the Air Maxes that I just showed y'all, the last two shoes. So yeah, now let's get into the next shoe. Now the next shoe hitting at $150 price point. Yes, I'ma keep it at that or lower. I'm not going over because like I said, everybody ain't got money like that to be spending $200, $300, $400 on some shoes. So the next one is the Nike Air Max 270 Reacts. I did a review on them, but I cannot find the shoe right now for whatever reason because like I said in a couple of my recent videos, my previous videos, I've been in the process of moving, so my stuff is all over the place. Like, I'm not even in my spot right now, so my stuff is all over the place, so they could be somewhere around here, I don't know where they would be at. But yeah, so I'm gonna have a picture up here for y'all on the Nike Air Max 270 React, so definitely, for price, they're a good shoe. Now, all I can say, the con on that shoe, the material, eh, if you see the review, you know what I'm talking about. It ain't, material really hitting on nothing. It's kind of cheap, but other than that, it's a good shoe for back to school. Colorway is great. It feels good. It's just the material as far as like cleaning it and keeping it clean. 
it, it, it ain't where it's at. So on to the next shoe. Now the next shoe is the Nike Air Max 97s, which I have right here. Now, these shoes before I open, oh, I'll just show y'all right now why I got the box right here. The Nike Air Max 97. Y'all good, look at those. These are a perfect back to school shoe. Any 97 is really just, any 97 is lit regardless. The Nike Air Max 97 is just undefeated in total. As y'all can see, I do wear these bad boys. But the Nike Air Max 97s are $150 depending because they're originally $160, but if you go on foot action right now, I see a lot that are on sale right now for like under, under I said under, under $150. So take advantage of it right now. I guess it's the back to school thing going on or the sales or whatever, but definitely if you want to cop some 97s, I say go on foot action right now. Take a look. They got a lot on sale. I just looked at it like an hour ago, so they got a lot on sale right now. So y'all check that out. But yeah, Air Max 97, $150, depending. Depending now, don't be like, oh, you said $150, they're 160. If they on sale, they're 150 and under. So there we go. On to the next shoe. Last but not least, and can I get a drum roll? That was a loud drum roll. But anyways, the Puma, I almost met, oh, I ain't gonna lie, I almost slayed that whole name. I just thought of a whole nother thing. I was gonna say the Puma. Dallas Cowboy, I, I I was my mind was just gone for a second. But the Puma Spectra Thunders. Now these are hitting at a price point of 120. Yes, I had to look at my list one more time. I'm gonna call it out every time because I shouldn't be looking at the list, but I am though. I am. So the Puma price point is 120, but they on sale at Champs right now for 99 dollars. So if y'all like the picture that you're seeing, y'all make sure y'all check that out. Now these, I'm not even gonna lie, when these first came out. I wanted the cop, but they sold out instantly. And then when they restocked, it was just like, I, I just didn't want them no more. But these are a shoe that I honestly, I might just end up copping just cause, cause they, 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 they lit, it, it's lit, man. So that's about it for the list Guap Nation. I just wanted to bring y'all some quick updates on the back to school shoes that y'all can get just to look out for my fam. Cause y'all look out for me. So I gotta look out for y'all. I gotta keep y'all in the highest fashion, keep y'all looking good. You know, cause you can't be Guap Nation if you ain't got the sauce. And if you don't got the sauce, you can learn how to get the sauce through Guap Nation. Because at the end of the day, we all Guap Nation. You feel me? You just got to pay me for that type of stuff. For them type of, you know, them type of quotes. Whatever, but we ain't, we ain't going to do that. We ain't, ain't going to do that. So yeah, Guap Nation, I appreciate y'all tuning in each and every video. That's it for the back to school list. If y'all have any questions, let me know in the comments. Y'all suggest more videos that y'all want to see down below. And until next time, tell your auntie, your uncle, your lizard, and your cat, and your dog to subscribe to Guap Nation because we're going bigger and stronger each and every day. And until next time... We are out.